What do dead people, greed, and real estate have in common? Cemeteries. In the young, progressive, and modern San Francisco of 1900, only the living were welcome. The future signaled progress, and the past was, well, dead. The story that unfolds is one that could only have happened in a place that had yet to develop a sense of history. San Francisco ultimately survived this transgression and prospered and thrived. So is this the right thing to do? I'll let you decide. In 1900, the city fathers capitulated to the developers and said, no more burying bodies in San Francisco. That the land that was tied up in uh, cemeteries around Lone Mountain at that time was far, far more valuable for housing live people than it was for housing dead people. San Francisco at the time when they shut down the cemeteries was only 50 years old. So the population of San Francisco, with the exception of a few old families, weren't particularly interested. They go ahead, move the cemeteries, you know, who cares? They moved those that were paid for very carefully and erected headstones and so forth. And then those that were left over, which would be 85% in some instances, they just scooped up with a steam shovel and moved into big mounds down in the cemeteries in Colma and possibly erected a monument, possibly didn't. They never moved city cemetery. There was no money, you know, they couldn't find descendants. It was a potter's field. And so when they covered it over with dirt, they had to do something with all the tombstones. They also had to do something with all the tombstones in the big cemeteries around Lone Mountain, where no descendants had paid to move the tombstones. So what did they do with them? Well, in some instances, they just broke them up in pieces and used them uh, in parks for pathways. They pushed them over the edge, over the edge into the bay, or they used them as breakwaters down at Ocean Beach. And then there are skin divers that go down in the bay uh, to read the, the etchings on the tombstones that they can find that were pushed into the bay. It's, it's really, it, it's, uh, it's colorful. <laughs>